Hi guys, I've got a request here from Agile Coast to do a rubber band powered triplane. Well, my main problem with rubber band powered planes is getting hold of a suitable propeller and suitable rubber because ordinary rubber bands aren't really very good for rubber band powered planes. Anyway, I just remembered that I've got this propeller plane kit that I've had for quite a while. Sort of thing I put in the back of the car in case my grandson wants to try and fly a plane at any time. And I thought, well, that's got a propeller in it that I could use. So I'll use this as the basis but I'll see if I can make it into a triplane. Oh, hasn't even been opened yet. I did make one of these a while back on one of my video projects and I seem to remember that the instructions were not very clear. Not that that matters, because I'm going to try and make a triplane out of it. So we've got a propeller. It's an interesting shape. bit of wood. It's quite a loose fit, although I seem to remember yes, somehow or other that's supposed to go in there and then a bit of wood goes in. I could always read the instructions but I didn't find them very helpful last time. Yes, and that was the result that the wheels sort of... that can't be right, can it? But I can't see any other way of putting them in there. I suppose I could bend them. in the way of the propeller. That's clear. That's the tail end. That's the bracket for the wing. Only we're going to have two wings. Three wings. Triplane, isn't it? So we probably won't be using this as such. But that would go on there like that. And then the rest of it all sticks together with sticky back plastic. And somehow or other that lot's all stuck together. Probably put in there before the paint had dried.
that's how that's supposed to go together with sticky tape holding it together so I'll just figure out if we can convert that to a triplane I use my normal polystyrene plates. They won't be quite as big. I'll see what I can do. I've cut six wings out of styrofoam plates. I've very carefully trimmed the inside a bit, a bit of a curve, so that we can get the airfoil shape and a bit of dihedral same time. I've rigged up a little former here so that I can get all the wings the same or fairly close to the same. I've got a bit of um, cane there to give me the fold or the bend for the airfoil and then that block of wood is to give me the dihedral, which is probably a lot more than it needs to be, but it means that I'm keeping them all the same anyway. Now I'm going to use the original wing mounting bracket and put one of the wings on it and then I'll put some struts to mount the other wings above it so we end up with the triplane. be nice to have one down below, wouldn't it? One below and two above. Depends how the rubber band has to get through. There's three wings. All up together. Rubber band powered triplane. We'll have to go and see if it flies. Right, guys, we're going to test fly the triplane. It's not very robust, so I'll be surprised if we get more than one flight out of it, but we'll give it a try. Well, I won't tell you what I just stepped in over there, but you can probably guess by the fact it's a dog walking area. Typical perfect flight that time right across behind the camera over the road but my wife's not here so she wasn't able to track it for me